What's happening people? Doug here. I just wanted to take just a moment and shoot you a video on how to update your settings for the new server in MacMail. Uh, I know that a lot of y'all guys since we've moved over have had some questions about how to do this. So I wanted to uh, run you through the settings here real quick. So in MacMail what you're going to do is uh, hopefully you can see this bar across the top. This is the mail bar it may be covered by my screencast o -matic one but you click the mail settings go down to preferences that will open this interface so if your mac mail uh, there's a chance that it could auto update and work if this button is selected um, if your password has been changed just enter it here and here your username is going to be your full email address your host name is going to be mail dot whatever your domain name is dot com uh, for this example we used our domain of media but if you're uh, you know widgetworld.com it would be mail dot widgetworld.com and then your email address at widgetworld.com so if for some reason your automatic manage connection settings is not allowing your email to work uncheck this box and then you want to change your outgoing port, or your incoming port. If you're uh, a IMAP account, that incoming port number is going to be 993. And if you are a POP account, that's going to be 995. So you want to make sure that use TLS SSL is checked. And then same thing for down here you want to um, if if you are trying to do the automatically manage connection settings if you want to try that first you can obviously go for that and see if it updates everything but if it does not then if you uncheck that you're going to change your outgoing server port to four six five click save it will verify and ladies and gentlemen that is just how simple it is if you have any questions, don't hesitate to give us a shout up at the office. Thanks a lot and have a great day.